Okay, question three from June 2016, M1. Um, a block A of mass nine kilograms is released from rest from a point P, which is a height eight meters above horizontal soft ground. The block falls and strikes another block B of mass 1.5 kilograms, which is on the ground vertically below P. The speed of A immediately before it strikes B is seven meters per second. The blocks are modeled as particles, find the value of H. So here we have a classic kind of uh, SUVAC question here. Okay, so you have your block A. Okay, so this is your block A. 9G. Oops. Its mass is 9 kilograms, so that's uh, 9G acting downwards. Okay, you have your horizontal ground. This is block A. You have your block B, which is at rest. Okay, which is on the ground. Okay. Um, um, block B mass is 1.5 kilograms. Okay, so basically what's happened is it's fallen down, it starts off at rest, it ends up going at 7 meters per second. It's falling under gravitational pull, so that's G here. Find the value of H. So let's use SUVAT here, we've already got SUVAT. SUVAT. Okay, S is H, that's what we're trying to find. They're trying to find the height that it's fallen. Okay, that's what we're trying to find. U is zero, V is seven, A minus G, and T we don't know. So we can use um, V squared equals U squared plus two AS. So if we use V squared equals U squared plus two AS, we need to find what H is, which is our S here. So V is seven, seven squared, which is 49, equals U squared, which is zero. Um, now I'm gonna take down as positive, because as it's moving down, okay? So plus two times G, Okay, which is 9.8 times h. So you have basically 49 divided by um, 2 times 9.8. Okay. Use a fraction that's better. So 49 divided by 2 times 9.8. That's 2.5. 2.5 meters. Okay, that's part A done. 